Hi, this is Luke with Harmonica.com, and in this video, we are counting down the top six harmonica rock songs of all time, along with tabs. So sit back, relax, and get ready to rock and roll. Starting with number six, Piano Man. Released by Billy Joel in 1973, this is the most popular harmonica song of all time, so we had to include it in the countdown. He's playing on a C harmonica in first position, and there's no single note, so this is totally suitable for beginners. Hey, if you'd like to be able to play this song with more mastery, you can check out my free Piano Man harmonica lesson right here. Otherwise, on to number five, Life is a Highway by Tom Cochran. Life is a Highway was a number one hit for the Canadian in his home country and reached number six in the US, his only song to hit the top 40. The song got another boost of wind in its sails when Rascal Flatts covered it in 2006 for the Disney animated Cars soundtrack. Sadly, their version does not have a harmonica, but in the original version, Tom Cochran is playing an F harmonica in first position. He's just playing chords, but he's playing some really nice syncopated rhythms. Check it out. Number four. Released in 1972, Heart of Gold is Neil Young's first and only number one hit. I wanna live. It appeared on the album entitled Harvest, which also went to number one, making Neil Young the first Canadian to have a number one record in the US. The song was written partly because of a back injury that prevented Young from playing his electric guitar, causing him to return to the acoustic. He plays his harmonica in the three instrumental portions of the song, and if you want to learn them, I teach them all note for note in my Heart of Gold harmonica lesson. I think Neil Young's harmonica playing is some of my favorite in the folk style of harmonica. On this song, he's playing a G harmonica in first position. Check it out. Coming in at number three. From the Rolling Stones 1978 album release, Some Girls, the song is Miss You, their eighth and final number one hit. The harmonica player on the track is the great Sugar Blue, who Mick Jagger is said to have discovered busking on the streets of Paris. The song is in the key of A minor, and Sugar Blue is masterfully playing a D harmonica in second position in the key of A minor, which is quite difficult. If you want to learn what he's doing note for note, you can check out my five Rolling Stone riffs easy to hard lesson. Hey, if you're digging this video and you want to rock hard on harmonica, you might want to check out my Beginner to Boss course. I teach all of the songs in this video very slowly and step by step. So if you like these songs and you want to learn them the easy way, go over to harmonica.com. Otherwise, coming in at number two, it's Roadhouse Blues by The Doors, which appears on the 1970 release Morrison Hotel. The harmonica on this track was played by John Sebastian of Love and Spoonful, and he's playing an A harmonica in second position.
And now for our number one rock song with harmonica in it. The year is 1973. The band is the Doobie Brothers. The album is The Captain and Me. And the song is Long Train Running. Try listening to this without bobbing your head. The harmonica playing from lead singer Tom Johnston is full of exciting rhythm. He's playing a C harmonica in second position. This is a great song for intermediate players. But wait, six rock riffs ain't enough. If you want to check out all 25 rock riffs, you can click on this video right here.